Hello, it's a bit late at night. I just want to find myself on my page so that we can have a good chat. Um, it is, what's the time here in Sydney? Oh, it's 10 to 10. It's a bit late. Um, I hope you guys are all okay. It's been quite a day here in Sydney. We've had quite a storm. <clears throat> it's still raining a bit outside and I hope no one's had any flash flooding and that everybody's well. Um, I thought I'd pop on here again tonight just quickly um, Thank you. I just wanted to say thank you to those who gave me some feedback So I thought I'd come back and do part two of the kindness notes of kindness A friend of mine just said to me. Ah, oh, it would have been great to see you make a card from start to finish Sharon So yeah, Sharon is <clears throat> Making a card from start to finish for you quick sticks um, so if you haven't met me before, my name is Sharon Hammond. I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Um, I work full time, so um, I enjoy doing this. And I like things that are quick and easy because I don't always have a lot of time. As you can see, it's like 10 to 10 at night and this is me doing this. Um, so I just wanted to um, show you this card quickly. Um, I'll just take you down here quick. <clears throat> so you can see here we have the different cards. So... Um, the one I'm going to be showing you tonight that I'm going to do is this one here. So I'll just make that one from start to finish. I'll just tell you what we're going to need for this one. If you haven't seen my previous video, you're more than welcome to go back. I'll take you through the whole kit. It's an all-inclusive kit. So you've got everything in this kit that you need to complete these cards. It's 20 cards with 20 envelopes and everything you need except for your own adhesive that you'd need, your choice of adhesive, or you could get the adhesive on... Um, at my store, um, Stampin' Up! have a really good adhesive. So let's get into this quickly. So this is the card that you would use, and it's a pre-printed card. And all you would do is just fold it in the corners there. And this is what you call a bone folder. Um, this is what you flatten your card with to get a nice crease. So you will just use your bone folder and you do that. So that's part of your card done, right? Next, we have this little die cutout. And um, this die cutout, really simple. You just pop it out. That's all we do. Pop it out. And that's part of it done. And these are your dimensionals. So you just pop. I normally just put, um, let's see, just take this one off. This one back on there. I like to put on four so that it stays on and gives it a nice lift. So that's part of your card done, right? So let's put that there. Now, the next thing you're going to need is it comes with a sticker. And so all you do is you peel the sticker off and it goes on top of your die cut. So here we go. Oi, oi, oi. Bit tricky, hey? This time of night. My goodness me, what was I thinking? Anyway, here we go. <laughs> so all you do is you just um, place it on your die cut like that. Mm, pretty, eh? Lovely, lovely. And then we turn our card. So this is a landscape card. That would be your portrait. This is landscape. So we turn it to landscape. So we take these little thingies off. See, and we're nearly done with the first card. Now, can you imagine churning out 20 of these, like, in no time? And it comes with the envelopes and everything else you need. And then we'll put it to the side like that. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And no stamping involved, dear people. No stamping. Just stick it on, pop it out, and off you go. Now, the other tricky bit, these are your little pearls that you get with it. Now, this can be a little tricky. I don't know why I chose all these tricky things at night. But anyway, here we go. So, there we go. That's one. Uh, that's two. I like things in threes. Oopsie. The last one there. And then we can do another three there. And that is your card done. How cool is that? Isn't it beautiful? So now, there's you, you can stamp inside your card, right? So the the 
the kit comes with this stamp set like thanks you're so kind it's got this beautiful little leaf it says thank you this is like a banner stamp and this is like little stars so you could quite easily um stamp a little you could use the stamp here and stamp thank you in the corner or you could take you're so kind and stamp it in there and um you could finish off your envelopes. It comes with this beautiful pre-lined um, envelope. <clears throat> and so that's your card and your envelope all in one go, right? So I also like to finish my envelopes. I'm a little bit like OCD that way. I don't like sending anything too plain. So the idea is you could take this little leaf, you could stamp it here in the corner, or you could just, um, you could put little stars on here. I like to finish everything off like that. So here you have this beautiful thank you card and so you have these ones here that you can also complete if you want me to show you how to do these ones from start to finish just leave me a comment below tell me what you think and also what i thought i'd tell you tonight is i'll give you a sneak peek of what i'm going to do in my next video so this year is a little tag tin and inside are a lot are a whole lot of tags that you can make quick and fast right so it comes preset with everything you need now i know everybody's probably done their christmas cards i haven't done mine yet um because i i basically give mine i don't post mine so I, it takes me what one day to make mine because i always have everything preset now i like tags because tags tags gives me that extra what do you call it advantage where i just put everything together and I put it on top there so when I um when I do my tags I use my tags as part of my card just like I did this cutout right so I'm going to show you in my next video I'm going to show you how I use my tags as a tag for a gift and how I use it on my Christmas cards so that it also goes quickly so I use I'll show you the cards that you can use you don't need to cut them out they come preset already for you. If you just give me a minute, I'll actually grab them. So, these, I'll take you down here again. These are the note cards. And they are already scored for you. All you do have to do is fold it. And then it comes with envelopes. And these are 20 cards with 20 envelopes. See, I'm all about making life quick and easy. So I use these cards. Mostly I use them for my Christmas cards because they're smaller, they go quicker. And I like to use the tags with it. That way I cut down on lots of time. Like I said, I'm time poor most of the time. So I will show you how to use that in my next video. And then I also want to tell you where you can find, <clears throat> if you have a catalogue, the Notes of Kindness is on page 7 in our, in our uh, 2018 catalogue. Now I know thank you cards is not everybody's thing, but really, you will thank me. There are so many people in our world that we need to send cards to or that we can give a card to just to say thank you. You have no idea what that would do for someone's day. You don't know what they've been going through. You don't know what their story is. And it's nice when someone's actually taken the time to make you a card. However simple it may be, you took the time to make it. You took the time to write in it and you gave it to that person. You know, just, just those little things will make someone's day. You have, you have no idea. I know I love receiving cards and things like that. So that's what I want to do finish tonight. If you want me to show you from start to finish how all the other cards were done, happy to do that. Leave me a comment and let me know about that. Then I also want to just pop on the screen and show you this. We have our celebration coming up and our new occasions catalog. And if you would like me to send you one, please send me a PM, message me or email me. And I would be happy to send you one in the mail so that you can get yourself together and start looking at this. Now, I am, um, goodness me, what was I going to say to you? I was going to tell you that... Um, these things all start in January, and I know Christmas is around the corner, but there's nothing like being prepared when everything starts happening, and it makes for good relaxing reading. Trust me, it makes for good relaxing reading. So 
that was basically all I needed to tell you. I um, I didn't want to make it a long video because I know it's quite late. And I thank you so much. If you're watching this on the replay, thank you for the time you're taking to watch it. Thank you for those who've tuned in live. Um, I hope you have a really awesome day. Um, I pray you have a good rest. And I look forward to touching base with you next week. Have a great night. Bye now.